So let's talk about Facebook Business Manager. If you don't already have one, let's get you one created. And if you have more than one, this video isn't gonna help you consolidate them, but I highly recommend that you move everything into one if they are both your own accounts and it's not just additional accounts that maybe a client gave you access to because you really only need one. Um, what a business manager is, is a place, basically you will log into it with your personal Facebook profile. So you need a personal Facebook profile to create the account and you'll use that same login to log into it. And what you do in there is you have access to all of your ad accounts if you have more than one, all of your business pages if you have more than one, uh, the area that you create custom audiences for retargeting, uh, your billing, and a, a few other things in there too, but it's one place to manage everything. So in order to create your business manager account, you're gonna to wanna to go to business.facebook.com forward slash overview. From there, you'll be able to click create account, enter the name of your business, your personal name, and the email address you want to use to manage this account. And once you hit next, you'll, I think, be asked a few other questions about your business, like your time zone, and maybe be asked to add a credit card right away, which you can always add later, but before you're able to create an ad, it is going to force you to add a credit card on file. So I don't want to actually create one in front of you right now because I don't want another business manager account, but super simple, super straightforward to just get the base of your business manager existing. That's all you gotta do. So when you're in your business manager, you're going to need to add your own ad account in here as well as your business page because it won't automatically populate. So what you're gonna wanna do is go to your menu. You're gonna wanna go to business settings and then you'll see this menu on this left side has changed. So this is where you can add more people to your account if you have other people that you want managing your ads or your business page. You can just click this add button and kind of go through the steps there. Uh, once you add the person, you will need to assign assets to them. So just adding the person doesn't really give them access to anything, you have to assign either ad accounts or access to the business pages, like I mentioned. So every person who has a personal Facebook profile is given an ad account. And whether you've used it or not, you can go in here and basically add access to it. So if you want to add an ad account, you'll be able to go in here, add the ad account ID, and from there you can give whoever you want to have access to it access to it. If you need to create a new ad account, you can also do that right here. Create new ad account and again you'll need to add the right people to have access to it or if there is an ad account that exists that you don't already own, you can request access to it here by clicking this button. So you have three options in here all to get your ad account in here and get whoever needs the right access to it, access to it, and it's as simple as that. The same goes for pages. So if you have a business page that you want to run your ads out of, you would just click pages, come here to the add button, and again, you can add, request access, or create a new page if you need to do that. One more thing to note about ad accounts is that with each new business manager account, I believe you are only allowed to create two new ad accounts until you hit your limit. Now, if you're actually utilizing those ad accounts enough, then you're able to contact Facebook through email or chat support if you have that and request access to more ad accounts. So that's just a little extra note in case you think, hey, I can just create a bunch of new ad accounts, but no, you will hit your limit, so be aware of that.